hello everyone we'll continue the rest of the points for the topic constructor now we will come on to next important point most important point in this whole topic of constructor your instance constructor is calling every time whenever you are creating a object and static constructor it is only only calling for the first time whenever you are creating the object suppose i will go to sc38 transaction code i am creating a program suppose i will give some title to understand the concept of constructor i'll take that type i'll save it as a local object i'll just go for a point i'm writing hello underscore object type ref to my class name this is my class name this is my class i will write create object object name now i will suppose again write the statement create object object name two times i am writing the statement create object to understand the concept of instance and static i am suppose writing the statement or i am writing a statement to create the object two times i am putting a breakpoint i am running the program now i am on 10 number line the object has not created yet whenever the object will create sap automatically call the method constructor now the question comes we have two types of constructor in this class which constructor will call first i am doing f5 and you can see my static constructor is calling first now if i am doing f5 again and you can see after that my instance constructor is calling so whenever you are creating the object for the first time for the first time always always your static constructor will call it is called first time whenever you are creating the object after that instance constructor will call now after that i am again creating the object i am again creating the object now this time if i will do f5 only only my instance constructor is calling static constructor will never never call again because static constructor is only calling for the first time when you are creating the object an instance constructor is calling every time whenever you are creating the object one of the most important point which will play an important role during the practical part so instance constructor is calling every time whenever you are creating the object and static constructor is only calling for the first time now this point i have not covered so i'll cover this point we all know we cannot call the constructor method explicitly 
it is calling automatically whenever you are creating the object suppose if i will go to pattern button a map object patterns i am writing the object name instance name i am writing the class name z class underscore 28 now if i will go for f for help of the methods available in this class you can see only one method is coming that is display method it means you cannot call class constructor and constructor method using this call method statement using this call method statement suppose if i'm calling this display method if i'm going for okay you can see this method is coming by call method statement but you cannot call constructor and class constructor method using the call method statement this is one of the most important points related to constructor topic we'll just go for a revision what we understood in this particular topic constructor are methods with a predefined name constructor and class underscore constructor you can call it as instance constructor or second constructor is called as static constructor you cannot go for more than one instance and static constructor in a class two types of constructor are there first constructor is instance constructor second constructor is static constructor instance constructor you can give the input parameters importing parameters here there is no provision of any parameters instance constructor can access both type of attributes instance and static static constructor can only access static attributes instance constructor every time it is calling whenever you are creating the object static constructor only call for the first time see if your instance constructor is calling every time it means you can pass the values every time suppose whenever the object is creating you can pass the values see in this constructor instance constructor you have a option for importing it means whenever you will create a object you can give the input values every time so its purpose is to pass the default values for every instance because it is calling every time in the future we have the topic alv by oops concept at that time this constructor topic will play an important role that's it in this particular video thank you